Good evening, folks. Welcome to another episode with Hayden Big Grilling. Now, tonight, we're going to make some Hayden's Heroes. That's right. That's a spinoff of Hogan's Heroes. I'm not sure. Pretty sure some of you are going to catch that reference. But we're going to make some Hayden's Heroes tonight. We're going to use the PK griddle here on the gas grill. And we're basically, it's going to be a hot sandwich. Now, I've looked it up. Different parts of the country call them different things. So, I went with Heroes just so I could call it Hayden's Heroes. So, let's get started. All right, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and cut up half of an onion. All right, folks, we just got our onions diced. I'm going to squirt me just a little bit of olive oil onto the PK griddle there. I'm going to drop into the center one pad of butter. I'm just going to kind of move that around. I want to get my, my griddle pretty well oiled up and buttered up, ready for the onions that we're about to put on. All right, so we've got our butter all melted. I'm just going to dump these onions onto the griddle. Kind of stir them around a little bit. Let them get start sauteing. All right, let's take a check. Look in on these onions here. Yes, they're definitely looking good and caramelized. So I'm just going to put this little tray right there on the top rack. Take these pieces of onion. Oh, put them in my tray for the time being. Now that I've got my onions pulled off, I'm going to... Take about three pads of butter here and just kind of randomly put them throughout the PK griddle for the next step. For the next step, I'm gonna start adding the meat. Now my wife, she only wants ham, so I'm gonna go a little heavier with the ham. But I stopped at the local Walmart this morning and had the deli tell them to shave it as thin as they can get it for what I needed to do tonight. Next, I'm gonna add some roast beef onto the griddle. And lastly, I'm gonna add me some turkey onto the griddle. Now that we got these three meats on here, we're just gonna kinda keep working them around. I mean, hell, it's lunch meat, so you're not really looking for a internal temp, so to speak. Just work them around till you think that they look good enough for you. All right, I think these are looking pretty good. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna keep them separated, but I'm gonna put them in that little aluminum pan that I got there. Now, before we do the next step, folks, I think I'm gonna throw me another little pad of butter onto the griddle. Right, now I'm gonna put my bread on the griddle. Now I've already went ahead and put some Miracle Whip on one side of each of these. Now on that bottom half, I'm gonna come back with one slice of cheese. Lower the lid and let that cheese melt onto the bread and let that bread get good and toasted. Folks, I put Miracle Whip on ours. That's what my wife and I prefer. But, I mean, by all means, y'all use whatever condiments you prefer. Mustard, honey mustard, barbecue sauce, ketchup. All right, so my cheese is starting to get good and melted. Now, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to grab some of this ham. I'm going to put it on the Miracle Whip side, okay? And the reason for that is when I flip this bottom bun over later, that melted cheese will melt down over, melt down over the top of the meat. All right, so now on this one, I'm gonna put me some ham on there. Then I'm gonna come back with some, put some of that turkey on there. Top it all off with a little bit of roast beef. I ain't wanting to cooperate. Move over to this one. Folks, we're gonna do the same thing. Just kind of spread it out a little bit. There's a little bit of ham left. Put our roast beef on the top. And now, remember the onions we sauteed earlier? Now, my wife, she didn't want onions on hers. Well, we're gonna sprinkle a little bit of onions in on ours, on mine's here. Last little bit. Yes. Now, I'm gonna take this bun here. Cause remember, like I said, I wanted that, that cheese to melt down onto the, the sandwich, right? So do the same thing there and kind of mash it down a little bit. I believe it was old Zeb told me that little trick, just kind of mash it down a little bit. Alrighty, folks, I believe I believe 
We're gonna call that gun done. Ooh, they looking looking perfect. Alrighty, folks. We just got them in the house. About to give it that all important taste test. All right, here we go with it. Folks, that was good. It was simple. It was quick. It's just a sandwich. It's a hot sandwich. But the buns being toasted, the cheese, even the Miracle Whip being heated up by being put on the griddle on top of the bun. But the ham, the turkey, the roast beef, the sauteed onions. Folks, this is real, real good. Simple, quick little meal uh i will damn sure be calling this hayden's heroes uh moving forward this was really good uh please let me know what you thought of the video let me if y'all try this let me know what you think because it's too good not to try it folks so and it's simple quick easy simple so y'all please like subscribe and we'll see y'all on the next one